Joe versus the Volcano also opens tomorrow, but last night Hollywood stars elbowed their way into a packed theater to get an advanced look at this film. Tom Hanks and his wife Rita led a parade of stars, including John Goodman, Dennis Hopper, and Molly Ringwald, at the West Coast premiere of Joe vs. the Volcano. On the way in, Hanks said the movie is meant as pure entertainment. No message here, just hopefully $7 very well spent. In the film, Hanks plays a terminally ill man who embarks on a fantasy adventure upon hearing the news that he's going to die. I'm not sick except for this terminal disease. That's right. You have some time left, Mr. Banks. Live it well. Hanks and co-star Meg Ryan are joined in the film by several veteran actors, including Robert Stack, Lloyd Bridges, and Abe Vigoda, who Hanks meets en route to becoming a human sacrifice to a volcano on a remote island. Tonight we will have a big feast. And then at the end of the feast, you will climb to the top of the big room and you will jump in, okay? Okay. At the premiere, Vagoda said he liked the role played by Hanks, but if he were going to jump into a volcano, he'd take somebody with him. I think I'd like to jump into a volcano with, um, with my wife. I don't know. <laughs> Joe vs. the Volcano co-star Meg Ryan is planning her next production. She and Dennis Quaid are getting married sometime this summer. The final results of the February ratings period are in, and it's great news for ABC's Good Morning America. The show beat NBC's Today by almost a full ratings point, nearly a million.